Hi guys. So yeah, I'm just gonna invite some people along. And so, and if you're there, please say hi. I'm just clicking some people just to see if anybody wants to watch along. Hello, whoever's joined. I can't see you right this second, bear with me. I'm just inviting a couple of people. Do, 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 do. Right, that'll do for now. Hi, Mary. So I'm just going to wait for some people to, to jump on. And I can show you what I'm up to. Hi Sally. I'm just waiting for a few people to jump on. Excuse the um, wild hair. It's freshly washed and it's still a little bit damp. So this is what happens. <laughs> Hi Suzanne. I'm just waiting for a few couple of people. Just see if I can invite a few more people along. I'm back. <laughs> Hopefully going to do something a little different today. So rather than just my usual makeup look. I'm looking rather pasty today. This is me in all my glory apart from a bit of mascara. Nothing on whatsoever. I got three people. I'm just waiting for one more person who said they were, were going to watch along, and then I'll I'll get started. Hi, Katie. <laughs> I'm just waiting for Pen. She normally watches along with me. Just seeing if she's if she's on. Come on, people. So yeah, if you're there, say hello, talk to me, like the video, share it, everything helps me. As many likes and love arts and shares and everything like that, all helps along. So I can see there's three of you there. So if you are there, say hello. And then I can get on with it, if I know who I'm talking to. With a little horror show in her cutting fires. Oh, bless. That's not nice. My seven month old had that a couple of, a few weeks back, and it is not nice. Uh, in the morning, when she woke up, she couldn't open her eyes, and it had to, I had to sort of pick it all out of her eyelashes. It's not pleasant. Poor little things. Right, I'm going to get started because also <laughs> you don't want to watch me rambling. Today, I'm going to show you some different ways to use products so apart from their intended use how you can sort of manipulate them to use for other parts of your face as well so one of the products i'm going to be using today is the touch a la mode liquid luminizer which is a liquid highlight um today i'm going to be mixing it in with my bb cream you can also mix it in with your liquid foundation to, oh smack me in face to create a sort of all over glow I'm going to be using it for my highlight as well. I'll also be using it on my eyes and my lips. So you're going to get four uses out of that. I'm also going to show you one of my favourite products, which is the Beachfront Bronzer. I can get my words out. I absolutely love these. They've got a tiny bit of shimmer to it, but not enough to be sort of glittery. So I'm going to be using it, obviously, as a bronzer on my eyes and on my lips. And then I'm going to be showing you the Splurge cream eyeshadow in the colour Proud which is um, obviously a cream eyeshadow I'm going to be using it on my eyes and on my eyebrows as well so oh and as a liner 
So you're going to get three uses out of that as well. So it's all good. So I've already moisturised and primed my face. I've got nothing on apart from just a little bit of mascara, as you can see. Because I'm not going to be showing you the mascara. So all I'm going to do, I'm just going to take my BB cream. I was going to use a liquid foundation, but I've used that quite a lot now. So I thought I'd show you a different product. So this is in the colour Bisque. And it's the second lightest colour. I'm just going to take a little bit and just put it on my hand, as you can see. Not too much, because this actually goes so far. Hi Keely, hi Jody, hi Trace. And then I'm just going to take this liquid luminizer. And I'm just going to plonk that next to it. As you can, if you can see that. And then I'm just going to mix it in together. So, let me find a brush to use. Do, 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 do. I'm going to use this fluffy brush here. So yeah, all I'm going to do is just mix it up in my hand. And all this is going to do, this will create a really pretty sort of dewy finish. I'm just going to add a bit more. I'm just going to add a little bit more. My brush has soaked up quite a bit of that. Hi Layla! So yeah, all I'm doing is just mixing it all up in my hand. And the... the liquid highlighter <laughs> the liquid highlighter will create such a nice dewy finish on your skin it's perfect for these summer months so I'm just gonna use the excess off this brush because I said we don't want to waste any just get all that off right so now it's all mixed up on my hand as you can see you can just see that little bit of shimmer to it it's so pretty and the BB cream actually gives a really nice full coverage. So I'm just going to get my powder puff brush and just dip it in. And just dot this all around my face. And swirl it in. And so if you want that sort of sun-kissed look, this is really good. It sort of gives you a nice sort of radiant glow. Almost like you're glowing from within, rather than just putting a highlight over the top of your skin. So, I'm just going to add a little bit more. And then, because it's um, a BB cream, it's really nice light formula and it hydrates your skin because it's a tint, like a tinted moisturiser. So there's no worry of your skin drying out while you're using it. So yeah. Just make sure, oh, eyelash. Make sure it's all nice and blended in. And as you can see, I don't know if you can see in this light. I've got natural light, I've got two windows next to me, so I've not got any ring lights. There's just such a subtle, Sort of radiant glow coming from the foundation mixed with a highlighter. It's so pretty. See, my camera's not doing it justice. I've just got this sort of subtle shimmer. So nice. Let's blend all that in. So that is the foundation done. It literally takes two seconds to do and you get such a nice sort of natural coverage. I say it hasn't covered, I've not used any concealer so you can still see, see my spots and everything but my foundation it does look really nice. Really sort of natural and not caked on which I, I don't like. So I'm going to go, hi Amy, I'm going to go to my um, bronzer. This is the Beach Front Bronzer and it's in the colour Hermosa. This is supposed to be good for sort of pink toned skin, which is what I've got. And as you can see, there's sort of a line down the middle. We've got sort of a shimmery side and a matte side. So that's really good. So it's not like overly glittery, over a shimmer, overly shimmery. It's really nice. So I'm going to be using this as my bronzer, my eyeshadow um, and on my lips today. 
to show you you can get more than one use out of a product you get your, so you're getting more for your money really so I'm just going to dab this in swirl it around and as if we're contouring I'm just going to take that sort of in my cheek what do you call it, in the hollows of my cheek and then up the sort of perimeter of my head and then onto my forehead and it's so pigmented and this is really good if you're like me you don't really tan but you want to look you don't want to look pasty in the summer and you want a little bit of a sun kissed look and believe me if you use this people will be asking you if you've been on holiday or if you've been on this sunbed so can you see already that I've got this really nice sort of sun kissed look I'm getting a glare from the natural light so I just like to take this all around my hairline and sort of bring it down. Got it all in the hollows of my cheeks. And I like to take it just under my under my jaw just to create that shadow. And then we can blend that out. So already we're looking really nice and sun-kissed. I'm going to go back to my highlighter. This is my, the second usage. I'm just going to put a little bit on my, on my hand. You can see that's a tiny little amount. As you can see, it gives such an amazing shimmer to it. And the tube's really big, so you can... You get a lot of usage out of this. And I'm just going to sort of pat this all over my, where I would normally put my highlighter. And get a really nice sun kiss glow. Now if you want a double shimmer you can use the powder in the same colour which is iridescent. And this will give you a blinding highlight. But for the time being... I'm just showing these three products off so. so as you can see I've got a really nice highlighted glow going on which is so pretty right onto my eyes I'm going to be using the bronzer for my eye colour so I'm just going to take what shall I take do, 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 do. go find my brush so I'm just going to take just a regular sort of fluffy brush I'm just going to swirl it all in and then tap off the excess Ooh. and I'm just going to use this as sort of my crease colour and if you look it's a really nice sort of golden golden shimmer Again, really pretty for the summer. And if you've only got five minutes in the morning, apply foundation, a little bit of bronzer all around, quick swirl with this and you're done. It's so quick and easy to use. Hi guys, say hello if you're there. Sorry, I had a message come up on my on my screen. So if you're there, say hello to me. I feel like I'm on my own tonight. Where is everybody? So is anybody there? Anybody coming to watch me? Coming to say hello? So yeah, I'm just swirling this all around, making sure it's all nicely blended out. Hi Becky! Wonder where everybody was, I feel a little bit on my own. So yeah, I've just shown taking a BB cream and mixing it with the um, liquid foundation, uh, liquid highlight, mixing them together to create a really nice sort of dewy look. And I've just bronzed my face out using 
this bronzer and now I'm using it for my eyes and I'm going to be using it for my lips as well. Showing sort of multitasking products today. Sort of a nice, quick, simple video. So if you do buy, say you buy this product, you're getting more, I'm showing, how, showing you how to get more than one usage out of it. So we've got really nice sort of golden smokiness going on. Let's put that down for the time being. And I'm just going to go back to my highlighter. Becky, what time are you going live tonight, darling? Going back to my highlighter and I'm just going to put a little bit on my hand, as you can see. And I'm just going to take a brush. What brush should we take? Oh, that's my brow brush. I'm going to take this brush again. And I'm just going to apply some. I'm just going to apply some to my eyes. And blend this out. As you can see, it gives a really nice shimmery silver colour. Fail off you there. See, I feel like I'm talking to myself tonight. Where is everybody? So as you can see, I've got a really nice sort of shimmer going on. And as it mingles into that bronzer, it creates a really nice golden colour. And then... I'm going to be taking this Splurge Cream Eyeshadow. Now, I absolutely love this. It's a matte eyeshadow. And I'm going to be using this for my brows and to deepen my eyes up. So I'm just going to take my trusty brow brush. Make sure it's got no excess product on it. And then I'm just going to sort of gently tap into here. As you can see, I've got the tiniest amount on. Uh, I need to be able to look in here and look in my mirror at the same time. Hi, Anita. So, this is what I was talking about last night. If you prefer to use sort of a cream, like a pomade, rather than a pencil or a shadow, a powder, whatever, this is a really good option. So, obviously, you can use it for your eyeshadow as well. And all of our products can, are safe to use on your face, on your eyes, on your lips, because they're all 100% natural. So you're not going to get any irritation. So you can use, you can buy a pretty colour in this and you can use it on your lips. You can use it as your eyeshadow. You can use it as a blusher. You can use it however you want to. You can do face painting. You can do Halloween makeup. The options are endless. So yeah, I'm just going to fill in my eyebrows. As you can see, it's a really nice colour for me. I did buy the lighter shade up, thinking that, that, that this one would be too dark, but it's actually perfect. And these cream eyeshadows blend out to a powder finish. So if you're always worried about cream eyeshadows and thinking, oh, they're going to be wet, they're going to crease, these don't. They're really pretty. Hi, Shirley! Just smudged it a little bit there. So I'm just going to fill in my eyebrows with this cream eyeshadow. Is it me or is it quite warm tonight? I feel a bit stuffy. <laughs> so the more love arts and likes that I get, the, the more people will see my video. So please feel free to like and share along. The more people the better.
You know when our eyebrow goes really good and then the other one takes a little bit more effort. <laughs> Thank you, Becky. Bex, what time are you going live? I don't want to miss your video. So this is really good for eyebrows. I absolutely love it. I saw another presenter use this and I was like, what the hell? So I added it to my next order and I'm so glad I did. This eyebrow is going a little bit wild. By 8.15, no problem darling. I will be there. Oh, I wanted to, um... oh, I'll talk to you after. I'll inbox you. So yeah, that's our eyebrows done. As I said, it's a really nice eyebrow colour. So what I'm going to do with this, I'm just going to take a little bit and I'm just going to put it in the outer corner of my eye. Hi Rebecca! And I'm just going to create this outer V. As you know, that's what I like. And is that going to be coarse enough? Yeah. And I'm just going to sort of blend this in. This is quite a coarse brush, which is good for blending these shadows. As you can see, I've just created that little bit of depth. As, like I said before, these these blend out so well. They go on wet, but they actually they dry powder. So they, I love them. I'm collecting all of the splurges, which are the cream eyeshadows. Just added two more. Um, majestic, uh, no, skeptical, and tenacious, which is um, skeptical is a glittery black, and tenacious is sort of a bronzy shimmer. And I've got a really pretty eye look coming up with that once they arrive. So as you can see, we've just darkened that outer corner. So pretty. So, I'm just going to do a little bit of liner. So I've got my little thin liner. Oh, I've got product on that. Little liner brush. I really need to sit and clean all my brushes this weekend, I think. So I'm just going to load my brush up. And I'm just going to use this to create my wing. So that's three uses out of this. I've done my eyeshadow, my eyebrow and my liner. Talk to me if you're there. I feel like everyone's a bit quiet tonight. Last night everybody was chatting away, getting all excited. Tonight you're all quiet. I've already done my um, mascara, so it's really difficult to get in tight to my line. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Hi, Leah. Just get my oysters ready. I know, I love these oyster parties. I get so addicted. Oh. Eyelashes falling out. You can get it. <laughs> so, I've got my... Eyebrows done, my wing done, I'll use it for my eyeshadow, I can just see a little bit of a bald patch there, there you go. That's that done already. I'm just going to smoke out my bottom lash using the bronzer, 
just so it all ties in. I say it's a really pretty subtle colour this. I'm not normally keen on bronzers, but they're really I am Leah. I'm doing it every night so people can see what I do and what the products are like. I'm just showing the different ways to use the product. So I've used the bronzer, obviously to bronze my face, as my eyeshadow. And I'm going to be using it on my lips. And I've used the liquid highlighter mixed in with my, my BB cream. I've used it on my eyes and as my highlighter. And I'm going to be using it on my lips as well. Speaking of which. So. I don't know. Should we do... Do the liquid one first. Again, I'm just going to take a little bit of the liquid highlighter. It's such a really creamy consistency. Make sure I've got no makeup on. And I'm just going to rub that all over my lips. And this is going to create a base. Then I'm just going to take my brush and just dab into here and just go over the top with this and it creates a really nice sort of rose gold lip colour and just really blend it in. A little bit. So as you can see I've got a really nice sort of rose gold look going on. If you tan naturally you don't need any of this. <laughs> so I'm just going to just take a little bit more of that liquid highlight and just put it in the middle. And create almost an ombre look. Pretty. I'm just going to take some down my nose. I'm going to just intensify this highlight. And there we have it. How simple was that? So, the highlight, the liquid highlighter, I've mixed that in with my foundation, which this is a BB cream, but you can you can mix it in with your liquid foundation. That's not a problem. I've used it as my highlighter. I have used it as an eyeshadow, as you can see there on the inner corners. I'm going to highlight my brow bone with it. In fact, if I've got a bit of a smaller brush would help. I've highlighted my face, I've used it on my lips. So how many uses is that? One, two, three, four uses out of the highlighter so it's not just as a highlighter I've then used the bronzer I've used it obviously to bronze my face make myself look a little bit more bit, bit more tanned a bit sun kissed I've used it as my eyeshadow I can just get rid of that <laughs> use it as my eyeshadow to create this really nice smoky look and I've used it on my lips to create a really nice sort of rose gold look and then I've used the cream eyeshadow to do my eyebrows, 
to do my eyeshadow and to create my winged eyeliner. And that is it. It just shows you that all these products can be used in more than one way. So you definitely get your money's worth. As I said, and because they're 100% natural, you can use them all around your face. You can use lipsticks on your eyes. You can use eyeshadows on your lips. You can use it all over your face, or obviously in the intended areas. Absolutely brilliant product. So this is just quite a short video, and it's just intended just to show you what you can do. So thank you for watching, as always, and I shall see you probably tomorrow night with a completely different video. Take care, guys.